Hello, welcome back to FIFA Save My Life. Thank you very much for joining me today on this day that I actually do a proper player review. I, I love doing player overviews because I don't have to commit to doing the players. Uh, normally I have, I, the, to be fair, better players or players that I prefer or icons or something like that in the place of the player that I'm looking at. Uh, so again, it's not a player that I can go for or again, obviously with my limited budget uh, with because uh, I'm doing a poor man's road to glory can I kind of commit to doing that player? There's been very few like that. Uh, but we've had a Ryan Kent, and I don't care what would happen. I could sell my kidney for him. Uh, I love having Ryan Kents in my team. So, guys, uh, I have done myself a Ryan Kent. I have played some games, and I'm back for a full-on, proper, sexy interview. Uh, Hard-hitting, uh, finding the right spot, and all the rest of the jargon that goes with it. Guys, make sure you hit a like and a subscribe before we start. It would mean a lot to me, but it would also mean that I can start growing the channel. Uh, if I could start growing the channel... I could do things like give prizes away uh, to create uh, better environments for the community. Uh, we can have lots of big uh, streams. Uh, we can do uh, pack openings and, and giveaways and, and all sorts of stuff. So, yeah, guys, uh, I am looking to do that. So all it takes is you to hit a like and a subscribe uh, and uh, maybe watch a video or 10. And uh, yeah, you can help the video, uh, the, the channel grow and join the community uh, and join the channel. Welcome. Uh, right, let's get on with it. Uh, let's have a look uh, and we will move over to uh, Ryan Kent. Uh, so guys, uh, we've got Ryan Kent. I've played some games with him. You'll see some gameplay going on behind. Uh, I haven't highlighted it up. I've just, I'm literally, you're seeing the game going on uh, as it was. Uh, again, it was a really good play, a really good team that I played against a couple of times. Uh, this was the final game. He actually scored four goals in his final game with me. Uh, he scored two goals in his first game and a one goal in the first in the, in the middle game. Uh, so this was the last game I played with him, and you will see that he scored four goals. Actually, you'll only see three goals in this one because I was going to use the old footage, and then I started playing really well, and I thought, well, do you know what? This is far more interesting uh, than uh, the, the other games that I've played. Uh, so <laughs> you've got this footage instead. Right, let's have a look at him. Well, he is Ryan Kent. Of course he is. Uh, he is... Uh, uh, he is amazing. Uh, we all know exactly how good he is, uh, but we have uh, different stats on him uh, than we've had before. He's obviously a striker. Uh, obviously, his famous uh, one that we had a couple of seasons ago was obviously a left winger. That was the one that, yeah, he, he became very similar. It was a showdown between Celtic and uh, Rangers. Most people actually picked the Celtic player because no one knew who Ryan Kent was. I was incredibly lucky that I, I've always been kind of a semi-Rangers fan. Uh, when I, from when I was a kid, I always kind of liked Rangers. Basically, a lot of the Everson players always ended up going to Rangers for some reason, and for some reason, we always ended up getting Rangers players. Uh, so yeah, it was one of those where we kind of um, uh, it, it kind of was a natural thing. So I just naturally plumped for uh, Ryan Kent myself. Didn't really know who he was either, and uh, thus the legend was born. At uh, and he was a guy who uh, made my FIFA twenty absolutely unbelievable. My first proper FIFA. Per first proper FIFA doing uh, streams and videos and that and uh, to be fair he absolutely made it amazing uh, so yes this guy has a four star five star he is a striker this time as I, I alluded to uh, so you can play him as striker you can play him as cam uh, you could literally play him anywhere uh, you could move him across to lamb or ram if you're playing like a four two three one he could literally fit in anywhere I've played him up front I actually moved out Ronaldo for a game just to give him a, or a couple of games to be fair uh, moved out Ronaldo and the Eusebio he partnered both of them at different times I think in this game he's partnering Eusebio yeah there you go he's partnering Eusebio and there's a goal uh, yes there is uh, so uh, yeah guys he is uh, outstanding uh, as a striker uh, but uh, I didn't really play him anywhere else uh, I thought he would uh, he just thrive up there right he has 95 pace he has 95 acceleration 95 sprint speed uh, his shooting is 88 so again that's more than good enough as I found out, uh, his position is 90. Now, I'll say something about his positioning. He was genuinely 
in the right place at the right time. You'll see with a couple of these goals, he seems to have just found space. Uh, he genuinely, I, I've not seen, I've not seen Ronaldo, R9. Uh, I've not seen Eusebio. I've not seen any of um, Eto, any of my other players. I'm not saying he's better than that before. Yeah, I, you're writing and say that I'm saying he's better than uh, any of those players. I'm not. I'm saying for some reason, his attacking position, even though it's only 90, seems to be absolutely spot on. Uh, and in the right position. He, in fact, he just seems to be... Uh, there you go. There's two goals from Kent straight away. Um, but he does seem to be in the right place. He seems to be in acres of space. He seems to find those pockets of like space that other people don't. Uh, so, yeah, it, it's been really, really, really interesting to sort of see how he, he opens that up. Uh, Finishing-wise, he's got 89. Uh, so he's got 90 shot power, 90 long shots, uh, 80 volleys, and uh, 63 penalties. Uh, just for a quick note, you will see on this video, uh, just before the guy actually rage quits, um, he, he to be fair, this guy actually tried to make me quit. He, he paused twice when he scored. Uh, both times he went 2-0 up, and he uh, paused both times to try to get me to quit. And then I won 4-3. Uh, uh, 4-2. Uh, but uh, there you go. There's uh, Kent in plenty of space again, guys. At, uh, but yeah, I did actually take a penalty and he did score it. A bit more luck than judgment, to be honest. Uh, we've got 83 passing, 87 vision, 80 crossing. Uh, we do also have 86 short passing, 80 long passing, and 87 curve. That's more than good enough, guys. I felt like he moved on the ball really fast. Uh, moved it into a uh, nice positioning. And uh, yeah, player, players were there to receive it and he was there to give it. I, I have absolutely no qualms with 83 passing. Again, if you're worried about it a little bit, you could probably up it. I, I'll be honest, I stuck a hawk on him. I, I, I didn't stuck a hawk on him. I stuck a, a whatever on him. A, the one where it does the um, pace and the shooting only. I just maximised that. Um, we also have uh, dribbling, 89. Of course, that's his big thing. 99 dribbling, uh, agility, 94 balance. Uh, and again, obviously, he has decent dribbling there as well. Uh, his defending's poo. Uh, but he does have 96 stamina and 82 aggression. Guys, Honestly, why are you still watching this video? You need to go and get this guy. He is phenomenal. Uh, one of the best players I've had in FIFA ever. And he's back. Uh, there you go, guys. Uh, I really enjoyed this uh, review. Uh, if you want to see more, let me know and I will do my best for you. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, take care of yourself as always. And if you can't, do you know what? Go and find someone who can. Uh, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.